still with the Queen Titsy and I'm about to show y'all how I refresh my braids. I have had these braids in for about two weeks, if you can see. I got, um, you know, some new growth. Not a lot, but mostly up here on my edges. And I also got like a bald spot right here and right here. Ooh. I am low-key postpartum still. My, you know, my baby's only three months. So I'm not going to take it as, oh my God, I have a big bald spot. I'm going to just take it as my hair is shedding. <laughs> but I'm about to go ahead and take these out. And then I'm going to get back to y'all when I'm done. my ball spots are so I'm gonna be putting I'm gonna put on some of my nourish and heal hair and scalp fertilizing balm is by my lovely fro um I have their stuff linked in an info box but I have this was from like years ago I forgot all about it but it's I remember when I did use it it was really good like a long time ago so if I could find the information I have a link below it's my lovely fro nourish and heal nourish and heal hair and scalp fertilizing balm is pretty good it's like shea butter or something so I'm just go ahead and pop off all the rubber bands with my scissors right here. I'm gonna go ahead and pop off all the rubber bands on the bottom and the top. I'm gonna put that um, the my lovely fro stuff on and then breathe rubber band everything.
sit under um, a headscarf. Just for about 30 minutes to really like set the hairs and stuff while I go run some errands. But yeah, I'm just, just, but I'll be back when it's time to take it all off so I can see the finished the finish product and result. So yeah.